Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To add a new task to your task list within the Tasks folder, click the New Task button in the New Button group on the Home tab in the ribbon in Outlook 2013 through 2010, or in the Standard Toolbar in Outlook 2007. In either version, you can also double-click within any empty area in the task list to open a new task window. Next, in the Subject text box of the new task window, Type the subject of the task. If you have to complete the task by a certain date, click the drop down arrow to the right of the Due Date text box in order to select a date from the calendar drop down. If the task has a start date, Select the start date by clicking the drop down arrow to the right of the start date text box to select a date to start from the calendar drop down. Click the drop down arrow to the right of the status text box to select the option which best describes the status of this task. Click the drop down arrow to the right of the priority text box to choose a suitable priority for the task. For longer projects, you can enter the amount of work completed on this task by using the spinner arrows on the percent complete text box. You can also have Outlook issue a reminder for this task. To do this, check the reminder checkbox to set a reminder. Then click the drop down arrow to the right of the reminder box to select a reminder date from the calendar. Set a reminder time by clicking the drop down arrow to the right of the date and selecting from the list. Any additional information required to complete this task should then be entered into the text area in the bottom half of this window. Also, as with appointments and meetings, you can click the Categorize button that appears in the Tags button group, called the Options button group in 2007, on the Task tab within the ribbon to associate the task with one or more categories. In that same button group, you can also click the Private button to mark this as a private task if desired. When you are ready, click the Save and Close button in the Actions button group of the Task tab in the ribbon of the Task window to save the task and add it to your task list. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.